Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Sunday, March 15th, 2020. This is 2020. I'm the Drug Poker Group, Tiz Beer Time. How you doing? Are you, are you doing okay? I hope you're doing okay. Um, you know, it's, 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 it is what it is. Let's uh, try and be kind out there. Uh, so the other day we went around Hamilton to support our local breweries, you know, uh, try and spread the love, spend some money, help these businesses out. Now, I know we are trying to do socially, dis to socially distance ourselves from others, uh, so go and buy your beer, head home, still support them. Uh, don't, you know, it just, we're, we're trying to do the right thing. Uh, this is an unprecedented time. So be nice to each other. Be nice to the people who are still working, who've got to work, who've got to work through it, checking on your friends and your family. Have a beer. I'll be here. Ming from Fairweather Brewing, sour IPA with pineapple, pink, grapefruit, and vanilla, never going home, 7.5%. Maybe never going home. So I hate to say it today, but uh, you know our friends at Fairweather are doing their best to keep the tap room clean, keep everybody safe. You should do the same. Uh, it, it is a difficult time, believe me. Uh, we do not make light of it. We are taking it incredibly seriously here, uh, making sure our family and our friends are safe. Uh, everybody's doing the best they can. But you also have to remember that life does go on at the same time. And you have to look for little sparks of joy in your day. Look for things that bring you happy. And for me, a pint, well, that brings me some happy. Supporting local brings me happy, too. So let's uh, take a sniffer there. Oh, I like the flamingos, though, too. Pink grapefruit, pineapple, vanilla, eh? Well, you're definitely getting the pineapple, grapefruit, and the vanilla. And then uh, there's like that, that tart smell. I don't know if you can describe it, but you guys know what I'm talking about when I talk about that kind of sourness. Sour IPA. All right, well, cheers, my friends. Breathe. Have a beer. Cheers. Oh. So it's it's maybe two, three degrees, maybe five. I don't know. It's cold. It's cold out here. There's no doubt. This is not a, a great patio day, but I make it a point to get outside and get some sunshine. If the sun's out, I got to be out there a little bit. Um, that is very bright and summery. No hint of that ABV. That is nice. The vanilla there kind of brings everything together, which I really like because I, I, you know, sometimes you look at these things and you're like, hey, is that going to work? But the pineapple and pink grapefruit give you that kind of tartness. It's sour, but not overpoweringly sour. It still resembles an IPA. It is a style that can be done very, very well or can go off the rails. This is very, very well. Like, I mean, uh, high grade. One of the best IPAs in Ontario, if not the best. I pick it up. You know, whenever I go, I always buy myself a bottle because it's it's like a comfort beer. Again, we talk about these things. And I like having these exciting beers. It just brings a, sm a smile to my day. So for a few minutes, I get to talk about beer and forget about all the stuff that's going on in the world. And that's okay. I'm not avoiding it. You're not avoiding it. You are just trying to recapture part of, you know, who you are. Don't forget who you are out there. So drink a beer, call your friends, call your mom, call your dad, call somebody, you know, keep the lines of communication open. Let's talk. Let's be kind. Cheers, my friends. Fair weather. Making great beer and bringing happy to my face for a long, long time. Cheers. It's really good. Should have bought two.